It was, it was incredible. <laughs> My mom always told me that the attention was all gonna be on me. <laughs> and I was like, I'm perfectly fine with that. I love her. You know, getting ready for the party, and, you know, just watching all the chaos and getting, being able to sit back, you know, and not have to <laughs> deal with too much. Are you guys done, Mom? No, I need to do it. Okay. 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 Okay
I think today is going to be, and I hope today is a day that she remembers for the rest of her life, you know? I mean, it's such a special occasion, not only for her, but for all of us, and me and Raydao as her parents. I mean, just um, work hard to try to make this day one that she'll always remember, and hopefully maybe, you know, talk about it to her kids one day. Deserve the world, and I hope she knows that. And hope she knows that'll give her anything she wants. You know, I'll do whatever I can. I know. And I'm someone that's not usually very patient, and I feel like the whole experience of the quinceanera really helped me learn patience with a teenage daughter, because it's not always easy. So I feel like the experience definitely brought us closer. I mean, we're already really close, but I feel like for me, I, f I have like this little, I don't know, it's like little special bond that obviously I haven't shared with anyone else yet because she's my oldest daughter. Sorry, I don't know what I do with that little piece of paper. That's probably gonna, I mean, it looks, it looks like it's where did Dad go with the bowl? So cool. How are we gonna put it up? Do you know where that clothespin is at? It was on your makeup bag on the little handle, but it was one like small one. Why is it like on one side? What? Turn her up. Because we didn't know how. I, oh, I think you said to this. I thought we did it to this. And she seems super excited. I mean, like I said, I, I just hope she has a great day. We're best friends and I feel like watching her today really reflects on her as a little girl. When I think about her, the way she's always loved attention, has always loved dancing. She's just a happy person and she's been through a lot and she's strong, she's brave, she's beautiful, she's kind and I'm proud of her. I feel like ever since we started planning it, it was just super like, just a lot of emotions for all of us. And I felt like all my family was super supportive and wanted to help and wanted me to have it. I'm nervous. Right there. What? <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh. It was, it was incredible. It was a lot of fun to watch her, <laughs> to watch her shine. I knew she would, but it was everything that I imagined. That's for sure. It looks so pretty. Can I walk up here? She was super involved in everything. We asked her what venue. We took her to see different ones different dresses, picked her colors, picked... She was, she was just super involved. Oh, it was... Oh, it's like it. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Hi. It's so pretty, Mom. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It is so pretty. I love it. I'm obsessed. It was truly my dream. and. Everything was perfect, like nothing could have gone better. Like I really truly think that it was my dream quinceanera and I'm just 
grateful for everything that went into it. The thing that I felt like made my quinceanera me was honestly the surprise dance. Like I feel like it was like that just the way that I was dancing and just having fun and like my faces and all the expressions I was making just truly showed when everybody watches it, you could just see my face and like the attitude kind of just, I feel like that really was me. Like everything in me came out and I was just shiny. For me, I mean, the surprise dance, I I knew, I, I watched it. I mean, I went to all the practices, but they did such an amazing job. Um, there was like certain little things that I guess I didn't expect some of her dancing, but <laughs> I mean, that I was a little surprised by, like she killed it. They did amazing and in tune with, with like with everything that was going on. But um, her surprise dance, like I said, even though I was there at all the practices, I was still surprised. I hadn't seen it or I didn't know, you know, what it was gonna look like and I think her and all her friends did a great job. So it was just overall like really fun, really energetic experience. And I remember for us it didn't end until like about like four in the morning. We Like I keep saying, like I'm very shy and it was almost like having that moment with her, it was almost like no one was watching. It was so special. We were so in that moment. It, it was emotional. We laughed. We messed up our spin, but I mean, it's so on brand for us for that to happen. Um, but yeah, it was, it was, it was fun. Like I, I'm very happy that she made me do it. <laughs> I'm really happy that it happened. Um, like I said, there was a lot of emotion behind it. Um, I went back and forth with like three different songs and we kept coming back to this one. So it was really special that we had that moment and that we had that song. It was always like our song, um, but it was such, I don't know how to explain it. It's like such kind of like a surreal moment because like I said, it really felt like no one was watching and we were just kind of like laughing, talking and I don't really even remember what we were talking about, but I know that we were just like really enjoying it. And it was, it was really fun. I'm glad that we did it. I was a little emotional. I mean, I was really excited for it. Cause you know, we got to have our own, you know, dance. Um, we had talked about it. We kind of practiced a little, like for like two minutes, like the night before. But I mean, I don't remember exactly what we were talking about when we had the when we were dancing, but I know it was kind of a, a funny conversation, you know. Uh, it was a good time. I definitely enjoyed having that a little piece and uh, something that I'll always remember. You have a big heart. <clears throat> Don't let anything or anybody ever change that. Don't change who you are. You're perfect. I love my sister Imani, and the kitten was really, really fun. One of the things that I loved about my sister was um, I'm glad that she was having so much fun 
Um, she looked so beautiful. She just enjoyed it. I just want to start off by saying thank you to everyone to come out and celebrate our daughter's quinceanera. Um, thank you to everyone that made it possible. We love you guys. Imani, I love you, baby. I hope you have an amazing night. And I love you, mamas. Um, I just want to also say thank you to everyone for being here tonight. All of our family, surrounded by love. A special thank you to our family, everyone that's joining us here on this floor right now. They made it, helped make it possible. That has truly loved and been there for Imani throughout all these years, watching her grow into the beautiful young woman that she's becoming. We love and appreciate you all. And thank you everyone for being here. <laughs> and to Imani, I love you. We love you. We're proud of you. Thank you for being at you every day. You're beautiful inside and out. And I just never want you to lose that light. I love you. <laughs> we love you. <laughs> we all love you. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Now let's party. <laughs> My parents, they, for my surprise gift, they got me In-N-Out and my first um, Louis Vuitton bag. And I feel like the In-N-Out was like really me. Like I love In-N-Out, it's my favorite place to eat. I will choose In-N-Out every day if I could and just like eating my little burger. Um, I feel like it just showed me because I didn't care to be messy or to like, put kind of a cover up, like I was just being me, you know? And I just feel like it was like really a surprise. Like I didn't even know I was getting a surprise gift. And when they sat me down, I was like so excited. And as soon as my mom took out the, um, the bags, I was like filled with excitement. And I was so happy because I was so hungry. It was a lot of fun to watch her, <laughs> to watch her shine, I knew she would, but it was everything that I imagined, that's for sure. I just wanna say that I'm very grateful for my parents and for everybody who was a part of my quince, all my friends, all my family, especially my parents and my close family who was in my quince and my friends, Like I feel like they've all watched me grow up and all watched me um, like become who I am today. And I just feel like that day was so special to me and everybody who was there knew how special it was to me and I just love everybody so much. Yeah, I just want to tell her that I love her and I'm proud of her. I'll always be proud of her no matter her decisions, her mistakes, like I'm always here for her, her family, she's loved by so many. Um, so no matter what she decides to do in her future, I will always be her number one fan, rooting for her no matter her like I said, her decisions and 